Father, we thank you, we honor, we glorify your holy name in this time and hour. Father God, as we come before your holy throne, we decree, Father God, and we declare that this is our year of open heavens. My Father, in the name of Jesus, there are no satanic altars that will contend us in the name of Jesus. Father, today we have come to fellowship with you, Father God. We are, a, we are here to say, Abba, Father, thank you for everything that you are doing into our lives. We are here, Father God, to celebrate and to appreciate every breakthrough that you are making against every evil plan of the enemy father god today we decree and we declare that the plans of the enemy shall not prevail not by any means my father in the name of jesus we decree and we declare father god that there is no weapon fashioned against us that shall prosper father god you you sanctify this service today in the name of jesus father we welcome and we welcome you holy ghost that you are with us in this now time and hour Father, we bless, we thank you, Abba Father, for establishing dominion in the name of Jesus. We thank you, Father God, for the power in this month, in this last six months. We thank you, Father God, for the authority that you have given us. Father God, we are here for revitalization. We are here for re divine order, Father God, in the name of Jesus. Father God, we give you praise for every answered prayers, for all our prayers that are answered according to our wish, according to our desire. We thank you, Lord for the blessing that you are giving us. We thank you, Lord, for the favor, for the grace and the mercy that you are giving unto us. Father God, we shall bring testimonies in the name of Jesus. Father God, we said in a word, according to Job chapter 22, verse 28, we shall declare a thing and it shall be established. Father God, today, whatever that we utter out of our mouth, it shall come to pass in the name of Jesus. Father God, we contend every satanic altar that has been erected against our lives in the name of Jesus. Anything, Father God, that is contending our breakthrough, my Father, today we thank you. Holy Spirit, we thank you. Said in a word, but upon Mount Zion there shall be deliverance, there shall be holiness, the children of Jacob shall possess their possession. Today, Father God, we are here at Mount Zion where we are receiving our breakthrough in the name of Jesus. We can all pray, we can all pray. Yes, my father, in the name of Jesus, Psalms 23, verse 1, I shall not want, we shall not need, we shall not lack, we shall not beg. In this last six months, in the name of Jesus, because we are Jehovah Shammah, we are Jehovah Eroi, in the name of Jesus. Father God, we thank for your presence in our lives. In Raka the Lord is my shepherd. The Lord, you are our shepherd. 
we shall not lack, we shall not want, we shall not need, we shall not, we shall not beg in this month, in this last six months of 2022. In the name of Jesus, my father, today it is our honor that my father is our 61 verse 7. My father, we shall have double for our past failures and shame this year in the name of Jesus. I decree and I declare double for every trouble that we went through in the name of Jesus. The Bible says in the book of Matthew chapter 11 verse 12, the kingdom of God suffered violence and the violence taken by force. Today, my father, we are possessing our possession. The gates of hell shall not prevail against our families, against our business, against Father God. Everything that we need, my father, today, as we soak ourselves in your blood, karakotoro, Yes, my father, we are taking our possession by fire, by force in this month, in this last six months, in the name of Jesus. Father God, we are using violence against any satanic operation in our lives. My father, any curiosity, any anger, any quarrel, any procrastination, any laziness will not make us to miss our promises, our promises, our promises. This year, Father God, is our year of breakthrough. This year, our God, is our year of your divine presence. This year, Father God, it is our year of your presence in our life. In my Father, Korah Shotan, in the name of Jesus. Father God, we say goodbye to all our Egyptians. We say goodbye to all our Egyptians. All the Egyptians that we see today, all the calamity, all the shame, all the sickness, all the demotion, all the frustration will be drowned into the Red Sea. Because Exodus chapter 14, 14 says, Oh God, we may see your salvation today. Fight all our battles this month. Fight all our battles, Father God. Whatever that is challenging us, my Father, you shall challenge it. You shall challenge it. Pray, 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 pray. Rakatanaba Sakata. Ekatanaba Sokoto. Rekataraboko Sakata. Paparo Kotorobosan. Ekatanaba Sakata. Sokoto. Sakata. Sakata. Repatanaba Sakata. Open your mouth and pray. This is a prayer service. Open your mouth and pray. Open your mouth and pray. You shall declare a thing and it shall be established. If God said, let there be light and there was light and you are keeping quiet. God wants to hear your voice. God wants to hear your voice. Speak. Speak. Pray unto him. Repakarakoto. Sekatalaraba seketu. Mama goto roboshan. Hekatalaraba seketu. Hekegeto loroboshan. Hayakata. 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 Hekatalaraba seketu. Hekatalaraba seketu. Sakatalaraba seketu. I don't hear you. I don't hear you. I don't hear you. All the Egyptians that are pursuing you, all the sickness, all the diseases, all the demotion, all the attacks, all your enemies, today they are drowning in the Red Sea. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, yes. I want you to invite God. Invite God to fight. Invite God to fight for you. He said this battle is not ours, but it is. He has called God to come and fight every satanic altar that has been raised against your life. Call God to come and fight every every evil plan the enemy has raised in the name of Jesus. Yes, in the name of Jesus, raise up your hands. There is a whispering voice says you cannot make it in the sea. They say you will never recover from your sickness. You will never recover from every downfall and every breakdown in the name of Jesus. But I want you to say, my father, my father, my father, my father I, resist I resist every voice, every voice whispering, whispering. I cannot make it. This year, this month, this decade, in the name of Jesus, I say you voice, you resisting voice, take fire now, take fire now, take fire now, take fire now, say my father, according to scripture, Isaiah chapter 6, 
Fais soi. The Bible says, Arise, shine, for thy light of breakthrough, of healing, of restoration has come upon the earth. My Father, thy reason, the glory has risen. My Father, disappoint every disappointment. Arrest every arrest. Destroy every destroyer. My Father, curse every curse in the name of Jesus. My Father, I am speaking protection of my household and those that I love. I am speaking protection of my ministry, of my children, of my job, of my business. Pray, 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 let God protect us concerning our business. Let God concern us, protect us concerning our careers, concerning our job, concerning our academic. Yes, my father. Say, my father, my father. My father. I pray for my children. I pray for my grandchildren. I pray for my wife. I pray for my husband. I pray for my entire family. I pray for my pastor. I pray for the congregation. I pray for the body of Christ. My Father, today, as I pray, as I clap my hands, I decree that my Father, they shall be protected. Pray, 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 ko raka karaba sikit. E zangha dalaraba sin. E ba para koto robo shana. Alla kata dalaraba sin. E kata dalaraba sikit. E kata dalaraba bebe bebeyan. E zangha dalaraba sikit. E kata dalaraba sikit. E bebeyan. E kata dalaraba sikit. In the name of Jesus, raise up your hands. And God, tenders, man, sons of tenders, you will be praying for two hours until there is something that must fall. Amen. Verses will not entertain you, but God wants to hear you speaking. Amen. We are here, we've got issues. I have my own issues that I must deal with. You have your own issues that you must deal with. Therefore, this corporate anointing, as we intercede for each other, as we pray, all the angels will immediately answer us. The Bible says in the book of Second Chronicles, chapter 7, verse 14, if my people who are called by my name, will humble themselves, pray and seek my face and turn away from their wicked ways. I, the Lord, will hear them from heaven. I, the Lord, will make it a point that I forgive their sins and I heal their land. I heal their bodies. I heal their careers. I heal their jobs. I heal their future. I heal their marriages. Start to pray and thank God and say, Father, I humble myself. I pray. I come before your holy throne. I repent from all known and unknown sweetnesses and it, and it seems in the name of Jesus raka taraba sekete zemanda rako taraba sen eka taraba sekete reboshan papa rako torobo shakata ela kataraba sen ela kata ela kata seka taraba sekete in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus i don't hear you pray i don't hear you pray clap your hands and pray Clap your hands and pray. God wants to release your job. God wants to release that business. God wants to release that marriage. God wants to release that property. God wants to give you everything that you need. God is giving you that healing. Repatata rabako. Eparakatata. 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 Sekata rabako. Sekata rabako. Pray, 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 pray. Pray, 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 pray. pray. So Rabase, Hela Katala Rabase, Hala Katala Rabase, Ayakata, 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 in the name of Jesus. Raise up your hands. Raise up your hands. Raise up your hands. We are frightened. We are frustrating the kingdom of darkness. Yes. Say, my father. According to the scriptures, Isaiah 54, verse 17, verse 17, 
Verse 17. The Bible says, There is no weapon facing it against me. Facing it against my family. Facing it against my church. In the name of Jesus. I swear now, every satanic arrow, every evil arrow, back to the sender, back to the sender, whoever is planning evil things against my life, today, my father, I decree and I declare my holiness, I decree and I declare that the help of the enemy is becoming frustrated. Is becoming frustrated. Rapa kaka rabo kusanda. Hila kaka la rabo sukuto. Singa dala rabo sukuto. Hila kato lo rabo saka. Hila kato la rabo sukuto. Sura la rabo bebe bebe bebe. Soko tolo rabo shaka. Singa kala rabo sukuto. Aya kata la rabo aya kasi. Soko koto lo rabo shanda. Aya kata la rabo sukuto. Soko tolo rabo shanda. Aya kata. Aya kata. Aya kata. Aya kata. Ayakata, ayakata, repa para koto robosa. Yes, pray, 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 pray. Break every evil arrow of the enemy. Destroy every evil arrow of the enemy. Frustrate every arrow of the enemy. Frustrate the frustrators. Frustrate the frustrators. Rata kara basikiti. Sumo tolo robosa kata. Hila kata la rabai. Hila kara rabai. Hila kara rabai. Hila kara rabai. Ayakata. Raise up your hands. Say, Father, we frustrate the kingdom of Jesus, the kingdom of, of, of darkness in the name of Jesus. My Father, we are coming, pleading your blood, blood of Jesus, blood of Jesus, blood of Jesus, sanitize us, protect us. My Father, my Son, let your blood protect me against the plans of the enemy. My father, you said, you know what? You are with me. I must fear not. So you are with me. Today, my father, I decree and I declare your divine presence in my life. In my life. In my life. My father, I pray like Jacob in the book of Genesis chapter 28. Yes, 20. My father, my father, I am raising a new altar, a vow offering, an altar. I am making a vow. I have nothing now, but I know you shall bless me and I will come and honor you and give you all the tithes, all the offerings that you need according to Deuteronomy chapter 12, verse 5 to 7, because you have placed me in this place. My Father, I am praying for your divine presence. My Father, you are Jehovah Shammah. Everywhere I go, you must be present. Today, my Father, I am praying, I am praying for your protection. You are Jehovah, listen in the name of Jesus. My Father, today, I need your presence. Protect me, provide me. My Father, sustain me in the name of Jesus. Pray, 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 pray. As I pray, as I clap my hands, I declare your divine presence in my life. You are Jehovah Shammah. Yes, my Father, everywhere I go, you are present. You are clearing every way. My father, you are Jehovah Jireh. You are the one that is providing us with every resource. Marako Toroboshana. Hela kata, 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 hela kata. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Jesus. Can you please give a round of applause? Clap, clap your hands to the name of Jesus. Clap your hands to the name of Jesus. Clap your hands to the name of Jesus. This is how we are welcoming you in this place. Yes. Can you please greet each other and say you are welcome today. This is a day of your breakthrough in the name of Jesus. Yes, in the name of Jesus. Thank you so much in the name of Jesus. We are a very big church. Can you please give a round of applause for everyone that is here and say when they got the wafiga lana because your things are here in the name of Jesus. Marakotoroboshakata. Thank you, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. In the name of Jesus. 
Yeah, yeah, thank you so much. I see all of you, you are my relatives. Eh? That's what I've discovered. We are all related here. Yeah. Yes, special greetings to my cousin. Makamet, Makatela Sestrand. In the name of Jesus. Mshanawami, this is my cousin. Mshanawami Tulani, Sabongakulu Tulas. And you shall use a Hey, hey, hey. Father, I'm going to Obi. Why, why, why? Obi. Yeah, so many times now. Maruma Tulani, I'm going to go Yo, how are you Tulani? So I get the service and then I put my poison. Thank you so much and special greetings to Oh Sisi Uzama Wagan Nube. Yes, Abaka was standing so that I took the camera that is by me. They go to the camera that is today. They visit the place in the name of Jesus. Yes, they are not staying around. And the sister, hey, you can tell them the summer and the seven and a quarter. The camera that is left hand here. Hi, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yabo thank you so much. We are going to see the and Pope. Yabo Mantana. Yabo Mantana, but Yes, 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 Thank you so much, my beloved daughter. I love you so much. Your mama of the prophet. Oh my God, I miss my son now. The name of Jesus. Then, as you look at being a little bit coming, that is, we may be seated in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Thank you so much. Sabona Lakulu Teps. Thank you so much, Sister Rose. Yes, Peter. Thank you so much, Apostle Peter. Everyone, and Tanda Lakulu, the Kamala. We are a very big church. Don't never mind. God has power packed us. We've got all the things. We've got our new beginnings. Hallelujah. Finally, I'm feeling that when complete, when I finally look on this thing, what to we need to. We've got everything. Everything is there. It's just a matter of going out in the name of Jesus. And I hope as you are here, you'll come back again in the name of Jesus. Thank you so much. I'm going to share in the Zandra. I'm going to come and get you. I said, okay. All protocol observed in the name of Jesus. Thank you so much. In the name of Jesus. Thank you so much. In the name of Jesus. Today, we are saying, we are attacking the altars, satanic altars. Every satanic altar that has been raised against your life, today it's taking its load and it's going. Yeah. Yeah. That's what comes out of my mind because I'm prepared for the because we've got issues. I may get some scriptures that will interest or to find that it's not speaking to you in the name of Jesus. I'm preparing for the Lord. I'm preparing for the Lord. I'm preparing for the Lord. I'm preparing for the Yes, thank you so much in the name of Jesus. Tell us what we need to call. I want us to just to be in prayer, intense. Rekatala la basa. Just for a few minutes, just to calm the situation. Rekatala la basa. Katala la basa. Shika katala la basa. Kotoro la basa. Ede tola la basa. De la rebianda. Se ganda la basa. Katala la basa. Le katala la basa. Kete. Zika katala la basa. Kete. 
in the name of Jesus. Thank you so much for being with us in the name of Jesus. We find our scripture reading from the book of 1 Samuel chapter, chapter 5 verse 1 to 7. The reader will read for us very fast and I'm rushing. We need to pray. Others are going. They are going back. Schools are opening in the name of Jesus. I won't be long with you. Half past 11. Surely I will be done in the name of Jesus. Chapter 5 verse 7. Chapter 5, verse 1 to 7. Tell me for the legend very fast. Amen. Thank you so much. Then the Philistine took the ark of God. Yes. And brought it from Ebenez to Ashdod. Yes. When the Philistine took the ark of God. Yes. They brought it into the house of Dagon. Yes. And set it by Dagon. Yes. And when the people of Ashdod arose early in the morning. Yes. There was Dagon fallen on its face to the earth before the ark of the Lord. So they took Dagon and set it in its place again. Yes. Oh, and when they when they arose early the next morning, there was Dagon fallen on its face to, to the ground before the ark of the Lord. The head of Dagon and both the palm of its hands were broken off on the threshold. Only Dagon's proso was left it, of it. Therefore, the, neither the priest of Dagon nor any who came into Dagon's house trained on the threshold of Dagon in Ashdod to his day. Verse 8. Verse 8. Therefore, they sent and gathered to themselves all the lords of Philistine and said, What shall we do with the ark of God of, of Israel? And they answered, Let the ark of the God of Israel be carried away to God. So they carried the ark of, of the God of Israel away. Thank you so much. Amen. Father, we thank you for the reading of your word. As we have gathered here in this place, Father, there are satanic altars that are operating in the kingdom of darkness. Today, Father, we declare and we declare that these altars, satanic altars, they will cry. First Samuel chapter 5, verse 8. What shall we do with the ark of God of Israel? Because we are raising godly altars against satanic altars. Therefore, it is imperative for us to acknowledge the presence of God in our lives. When Satan is raising his altars, we need to also to raise the altar of God. In the name of Jesus. Our enemies tonight, as we are starting throughout the rest of this year, they will they will cry, why did we touch the cabinet? Why did we touch Pearl? Why did we touch this woman and the man of God? They will be tormented. They will be frustrated. All arrows of infinity that are fashioned against you will go back in the name of Jesus. We decree and we declare that the altar of God as we are raising it today is, is, is fighting the satanic altars. When we say altar of God versus the altar of Satan. Sometimes there are certain situations that we may find ourselves in. There are certain problems that we may find ourselves in. Don't worry, maybe it is just the setup of God. Because God sometimes wants to go and visit the camp, the stronghold of your enemies. Sometimes you can try it by yourself. Prayers cannot change any situation. Corporate prayers, individual prayers, whatever types of prayers, bulldozing prayers, spiritual warfare prayers, we quote scripture. You know, the kingdom of darkness cannot be shaken because the altars have been raised and they spoke vows. They made decrees. And these are some of the generational altars that were raised from one generation to another. 
Therefore, you yourself, you don't know, you cannot even track your history where you come from. It is imperative for you to know where you come from in the name of Jesus. Therefore, it is my prayer tonight, it is my prayer today that we, I said it tonight, and it is tonight, I will explain to you some other time. Hello? In the spiritual warfare, this is night. At night, it is what? It is the day. Six o'clock in the evening, it is the beginning of the new day. In the name of Jesus. I don't want to confuse you at this time and hour, but I will explain it, everything to you. It's very crude around those matters in the name of Jesus. Listen, there are some altars that we raise generationally. These altars were said you must never ever prosper from your great 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 grandfather to now. Do you understand what I'm saying? So now coming back to the scripture, before I just go out of the way, I just want to explain the scripture. When you read the book of First Samuel chapter, chapter 1, it speaks about Hannah being provoked by Penina and 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 do you understand what I'm saying? Then she had to go to Shiloh and pray and to break all the altars that were raised against her. Her womb was barren, but God was able to open the womb. What made Hannah to get a breakthrough? It was because she went to Shiloh. She prayed, she called upon the Lord. She trusted in God. He, her by herself, she had to go. She raised an altar of God and she prayed and, and the God broke that barrenness. Amen. There are certain things that are holding you back you cannot produce. But it will take you to stand up, to come to Shiloh, to come to the place, to come to the place of God for you to pray. Being prayed for is not enough. Being laid hands is not enough. Yes, it is good, but it is not enough. But it needs you to open your mouth and start to speak. Because the Bible says, you shall decree a thing and these things that you are speaking around, they shall be established. Isaiah 55 verse 11 says, whatever I speak out of my mouth, it will never come back empty, but it will have established what I intended to do. God wants to hear. Do you understand me? The devil messed up. The earth was empty, dark, and void. But it took God to speak. He said, let it, let it be light. Therefore, we are going to speak today. We are going to speak to our destiny, to our future, to everything in the name of Jesus. Amen. Then we see from verse 10 now, in uh, chapter 2, we see Anna is praising God because now she gave birth not only to someone. There was a there is a stage where you need to, to enter into an agreement with God. To say, Father, I know that you need a prophet, but I need a son. Give me this prophet. Give me a son, I will give you a prophet. Because you cannot do it. Until she entered into that agreement. When she entered into that agreement, you know, sometimes you may undermine you. She passed by. Oh, she went there. We don't recall her now going to Eli and say, Eli, I've got this problem. Because of Eli's weaknesses. Sometimes we may be judged by one or two, three things, but you need our blessing. Irrespective of our weakness, irrespective of the challenges that we are going through, I am still your father, he is still your father, she is still your mother in the Lord. She needs, you, you, you need the blessing of the father in the Lord. She bypassed. What made her to get a breakthrough? Is that it? Eli said, I don't understand you. Are you drunk? Why do you behave like drunk people? You know the protocol. Oh, by the way, you understand that my sons, I am unable to maintain my sons or to bring discipline. That's why you are undermining my authority. What is it? May God grant you your heart desire. And from that day after the prophet spoke, I don't know how many years she went to Shiloh up until a prophet of God had to speak a word, had to speak a blessing in the name of Jesus. Because we are being appointed, we are bestowing your blessings in the name of Jesus. But we love to right size, undermine, and end. And, and, and. That's why we are sometimes missing our breakthroughs. On the day 
But I love her courage because she went there even. She went to thank nothing. Penina went there. Even the children were saying, thank you, Mara. You gave us the, the iPad 12.9 inch. We, 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 are, we are 10 at home. My mother, Penina, is doing well. Even Penina, thank you, Lord, for opening my womb. I am giving back like pigs. They went there to thank God for something which is tangible. But also, and I went in there to thank God for nothing. The prayer of faith. We may have nothing today, but let us thank him in advance that today we are getting our breakthrough. If you are desiring for that promotion, for that job, for that healing, for that establishment of the business, I declare and I declare as a prophet of God that you have received it, receive it, receive it, receive it, receive your breakthrough. You've been toiling looking for a job. You can't get your job. The enemy is fighting, is hiding your documents as a proof that you've got a qualification. But today I decree and I declare that your documents are coming. You are getting your job in the name of Jesus. I am speaking healing, deliverance in the name of Jesus. We are destroying satanic altars. Do you know why? Because we are the destiny carriers. To learn you are destiny carrier. Spend this is this is Therefore, they are not they are attacking the seed, they are attacking the destiny carrier. That's why the Bible always will mention about the sins more than about the father. They are regarded as people who are containing us. But our destiny carriers are not the girls. But it is what? The men. There are certain satanic altars the enemy has raised to kill our children. Wolfney and Phineas altars were raised against them so that they can misbehave. They were doing all these nonsensical things in the church. To a point that when they went to go and fight against the Philistines, they lost the game. When they lost the game, they had to come back to say, let us come and take the ark of God so that God can fight for us. Because he is saying in the book of Isaiah chapter 41, fear not for I am with you. I will hold you with my right hand. I will fight for you. Relax. He's saying this battle was never yours, but is his. Therefore, they relied on those scriptures to say, He said, Fear not. The Egyptians that you see today, you shall see them no more. The Philistines that you see today, you shall see them no more. Ah, but they missed out. They took the ark of God with the hope that God was going to fight for them. But unfortunately, the sins. Made it a point that they don't progress. But nevertheless, God had an intention of visiting Ashdod. Because Ashdod is a stronghold of the Philistines. All your enemies, they've got their own stronghold. Because you know, you know, Ashdod has become a thorn in the flesh of the Israelites. From the way when you take it back to Joshua, in the book of Joshua, chapter one, verse five, God said, "No man will be able to stand before you on the days of your life. You shall progress." 
when Joshua took over, Joshua chapter 11 started to fight. He left three nations or cities or countries. I don't know how. I don't know how. He left Gath. He left Ashdod. He left Gaza. And these three nations, they grew worse. Ashdod should have been destroyed according to the instruction of God. When you read the book of Deuteronomy chapter 33 from verse 50 to 56. And he said in verse 56, If you do not deal with your enemies, your enemies will deal with you. And I will do that which I intended to do to your enemies to you. Therefore, you will be in a crossfire. When I shoot a bird, I will shoot together with a tree. You will be affected. Today, there are some things that we missed out. Therefore, we are here to correct that in the name of Jesus. Ashdod was left. When you look at your Gazas, Gaza produced Delilah. That's why we have prostitutes today. If Gaza was destroyed, we are not going to have prostitutes. They left Gaza. If Gaza was destroyed, we were not going to have Goliath. We are not going to have champions against our lives. People that are dominating, intimidating us. These are the satanic altars that were mistakenly left by Joshua. It was not Joshua per se, but you know, everything falls in the leader. If I'm a principal of a school, and if the school is not performing, who must account? It's me. I am not teaching, I'm not in contact with the class, but I'm the one who's accountable. Do you understand what I'm saying? There were 10 spies that were there. These 10 spies who said we saw Anakim, we saw ourselves as a grasshopper. Then they had that mentality of a grasshopper mentality. That's why they were not able to defeat. They left Gaza and Ashdod. Come Ashdod now is becoming a stronghold because Ashdod now has got it. They have got that is called Dagon. Back on half men, half fish. They worshipped them. They started now to attack the Philistines. They've been attacking. The, the Philistines started to attack the Israelites. Then in chapter 4, when they fought, they were defeated. Then the Philistines took the ark of God in chapter 5. When they went there, they made a mistake. They took the of God which is an altar of the Israelites to go and places in the altar of the Philistines that was Dagon where Dagon was there Dagon was just a statue when they placed there the following day Dagon was falling on his face they lifted him up to say ah ah the following day when they went there they found Dagon being blown into pieces therefore it is my prayer today that God will visit the stronghold of your enemies. That which is holding you back. La pepe wa kona. Ugu kula wako. La pepe wa kona. Ugu feila wako. La pepe wa kona. Ugu telela wako. La pepe wa kona. Uja nekube le pisnisi. Today, God is visiting that place. Every knee shall bow. Every tongue shall confess. That Jesus is the Lord. If the God back down, what about all your strongholds that are fighting against your marriage? What about your strongholds that are fighting against your academic achievement, your business achievement, your work, your promotion? You name the list goes on. Therefore, I decree and I declare as a prophet of God that it, the ark of God is visiting the camp of your enemies in the name of Jesus. We say fire for fire. We say fire for fire. I decree and I declare that all your enemies will have a brain tumor. Do you know what is a brain tumor? Meningitis, brain tumor, so many brain tumor. Who's a part of your kind? Your kid is old. So many of you are kind. That do Satan can't deal with all of you. Oh my God, the things. Those altars were making the Israelites to be frustrated. Therefore, every frustration the enemy has erected, it must go back to the sender. It must go back to the sender. It must go back to the sender. 
What shall we do with Makamete? We are we 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 can't sleep. She is she is troubling us. What shall we do with Spirit Kamine? She is he is troubling us. We can't sleep when I carry a microphone when I pray at midnight. These prayers are going and shaking all the foundations of your enemies in the name of Jesus. When you arise at midnight according to Psalms chapter 119 verse 62. Amen. At midnight I shall arise and give praise unto God. Amen. When you arise at midnight it is your time of your deliverance. It is your time of breakthrough. It is your time of escape from the camp of the enemy. You are leaving your Egypt. You are going to your destiny. Wherever they are arrested you, all the gates of the jail, all the doors of the jail shall be open because you have raised the altar of God. Amen. Did you know that the prayer is an altar? Amen. Amen. Did you know that? Amen. A prayer is an altar. Yes. I love praying. I'm activating my altar. I just start by telling them, "I'm not telling them. I'm not going to tell them. I'm not going to put that in them." Man, I'm perpetual. I'm so much shy. I love the crossroad. I love the crossroad. Cause the confusion. I call all powers from the north, south, east, and west to come and send you. Therefore. We are not fighting flesh and blood, but we are fighting principalities, superpowers. I want your enemies to cry. Yes, they said, no, let us move this. It must go to Gath. Yes, we have we have experienced this. The altar moved from Gath, from, from, from Ashdod to Gath. And people of Gath also experienced brain tumor. Until they decided to say, I let it go back to Israel. They will release you, raise up your hands. Where you are caged, where you are caged in those altars, that be tattoo corner, it can make a color beba. That be when you work on the symbol, to our no tulan, when you stand in, so when you spew and carry in, when I will mean, hey, the camel that Jesus, they are releasing you, they are releasing you. You are coming out, Shai Santa, you are coming out, you are coming out from where you are being arrested in the name of Jesus. There are satanic altars that we call prisons. You remember Peter was arrested. He was in a prison. That was the altar of the Jews. When they want to kill you, they will put you first in the prison. They killed James, brother of John. And the people celebrated. They said, now we are going for Peter. And Peter was left with few hours because following day in the morning he was going to be released and be killed. Therefore, you cannot die. You are the Peter of this day. You are the Peter, you are the Peter of this generation. But I love the church of Peter. They raised a prayer altar against that satanic altar. When you read the Hebrew Bible, when you read the King James Version, they say the gates were opened. The chains fell. The doors were opened. But when you read the but the Greek Bible, what is it? The Greek, it will say God, stem is pulled out the gates. The angel of the Lord took all the gates, took all the doors, messed up with the building, messed up with the surrounding. That's why Peter was not arrested again. I was worried to say, Lord, why was he not re-arrested? These people had power. But when I read the scriptures, I was told that the gates were taken away. Every, the doors, the windows, everything. <laughs> Raise up your hands. Say, my father, my father let all the doors, let all the gates, let all the windows that have locked me in this satanic court be taken away. Angel of the Lord, Angel of the Lord, Angel of the Lord, I provoke you. Come now, my Father, release me from every satanic cage in the name of Jesus. Deuteronomy chapter 4. 
Verse 24. For the Lord to God is a consuming fire. He is a jealous God. Say, Father, you are a consuming fire. Father, Father you are a consuming fire. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. My Father, my Father. According to Deuteronomy. Chapter 9, verse 3. But I understand that today your, you, God, will go across a head of consuming fire. My Father, my Father. I will destroy them. I will subdue them. Before them, my father, I will drive away every annihilate in the name of Jesus. Father, today you are our country, God. According to Hebrews chapter 12, verse 29. For our God is a consuming fire. Yes, 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 yes. Raise up your Say every strange altar. Every strange altar. You know, some of the altars they need prayers. Some of the altars they need God's visitation. Some of the prayers they just need what? The fire of God. Amen. Say every strange altar. Resisting my glory. Be destroyed by the Holy Ghost fire. Holy Ghost fire. Holy Ghost fire. Destroy every strange altar resisting my glory in the name of Jesus. It's a consuming fire. It's my father, I carry fire. My father, I carry fire. I carry fire. I carry fire. Holy Ghost fire. You are in me. When I speak, I speak fire. When I speak, Things are being established. Raise up your hands. Did you know that people can be altars? They are walking altars. Hello? Umuntu jabe yu altar. Amela ni na awit. Agu shoputu sabatoo ya ngapi. Ese ngapi. Tino yaba experience na mbubatu na. And they think I'll be frustrated. I'm not frustrated. They are giving me more revelation. Mina I take problems very positive. Hello? You understand when you take problems positively, so take the problem very positive. If problem is of destroy, it's of destroy if you're not in good standing. I mean, I use it, that's how God has given me. I must taste problems, then out of those problems, I get scriptures and told my sermon sending a move at the pandemic. Look how far he is. I am international. If it was not because of my enemies, I was not going to do what I'm doing. Therefore, we bless the Lord. Thank, thank God for your enemies. Shai Zanda for my 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 enemies. As in push and what is in Osim, the Kama letters, Connes in Zimo, as in Pushella, who would in Saben Kulukul. Since I'm a young guy in the seventh, but must have Kulukulia seventh. He's a consuming fire. I remember this man, Elijah the Tishbite. In the book of Second Kings, chapter one, you'll read it by yourself. The king, the Asseven king, was looking for him to say, ah, ah, We want Elijah. He must come here. The last time when they last saw Elijah, they, they last saw Elijah when he was running away from Jezebel. Because Jezebel said, The way how you kill my prophets, that's how we are going to die. He had to run. Ah, 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 ah. He ran 120 kilometers per hour. And he was sitting under the tree very tired and he said Lord I'm the only prophet that is existing now please kill me I want to die oh the enemy saw that he was there then the assailant started to send 50 plus 1 to say go and call Elijah go and arrest him when they look for Elijah Elijah was no longer where he was he was on top of the mountain raise up your hands 
and say, Father, Father I am no longer down. I am no longer in the valley, but I am in the mountain. I am in the fountain. No one can come in the name of Jesus. Do you know the king of Lesotho? Sure, sure. They said he was on the mountain. When the Zulus came, wanted to possess Lesotho, they fed. Because Mshua Mshua will roll the stones. Will roll the stones. Will roll the stones. And then the Zulus will be. Do you understand? It was a strategy. But now Elijah never rolled the stones. They said, prophet of God, come down. He said, if I am a man of God. You are respecting me. You say I'm a man of God. Others are saying, there's no pastor who spends a room sin. Therefore you can't destroy me because already you have given me the name that God has anointed me with. They said fire come down and the fire came down consumed to the 50 plus one another kept in with the 50 they were sent again Amen. these walking altars were destroyed by the fire of god in the name of jesus in the name of jesus when we talk of altars we are talking about a place of transaction we are here this is the altar of god say this is the altar of god a place of prayer a prayer a prayer, a prayer that comes from this, from this altar is listened by God in the name of Jesus. We are, I am destroying some of the altars that I raised in this house. Hello? I'm doing deliberately so. I raised very strong altars. Therefore, the only way to destroy these altars it is to ensure that we cancel them and establish the altar of God. Therefore, in your homes, you can go and establish the altar of God. We have a big parcel of Okoko, sekseke ashipina. Awa, kia kwa. Kohaute, kia ashipina bokoko. Shisa nempe, bokoko sene hamba. Le kai msa mina zazi zinazenzwa. I get. In the name of Jesus. Altars can speak negative things. Altars can speak positive things. Altars that are speaking negative things. No wonder why where we are. Do you know that where we are, it's not where God wants us to be. Do you know there are negative altars that are speaking against our lives? That's going to be 2007. 20? 22. 22. There are certain altars. Ulai how ten baton. But you see yourself in Newcastle. Physically, you are here. Spiritually, you are back there. What is it? Kile kile Lord and Pastor. Kile kwa kuma hai karo no sekai. Spiritual oshi wekai. You need deliverance. Next prayer. Because I raised the altar there in the church. You said, This is my place of worship, the place of prayer. Raise up your hands. Any altar. That is speaking negative against your life. We destroy it by fire in the name of Jesus. Any altar that has been raised against your life, that nothing good is going to work out in your life, we cancel it in the name of Jesus. Listen here. There are also altars. Where, you know, when you raise an altar, but we are nigella. You make a sacrifice. Tina speaking Zangomas. Baba no try nyanya salab. A father, a father, a muambo, a one muambo, so I want a little. A father so, a one. Says one of you. Hello? He moves. That's my father, a young. I had to spare me a tie here. A young or ten per cent, he moves. But we are connected to our altars. When what is it that you are going to show off? 
you still listen to the misleaders, people already, they've got everything. They've got private jets, they've got everything. They benefited out of that. Though they misused the word of God for their own selfish benefit today because now they want to repent. When you say, okay, it's fine. If you say tithes are not there, give it back. They said, no, 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 no. The man who has his papa, no, no, just no, what to his give him one rope band. I want to tell you that an altar there must be a sacrifice. Must have a shabby seat. You also raise an altar. I love you guys because you are raising altars. Nanto. You see, what I'm dressing is an old. Somebody bought it for me. Most of my suits, someone is buying for me. Do you understand? Hello? Yes. I'm speaking a blessing. Mm. And a God is blessing them too. Others are getting jobs, others are getting promotions, others are getting healing. It, you are connecting. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Jesus. Therefore, raise up your hand. Say, My Father, my Father. in the name of Jesus, any negative God that has been raised against my life, any covenant that has been made, any blood shedding in my life, in my property, in my business, my Father, today I decree and I declare, My Father, that my Father, you break it. Come now, let your altar destroy every satanic altars that have been raised against our lives in the name of Jesus. My Father, whatever evil decrees that have been made against our lives, my Father, today I revoke it, I reverse it, I reverse it, I cancel whatever decree that was spoken on those satanic altars. <laughs> against my life any offering any sacrifice that was made on my behalf in the name of jesus i cancel any offering any renewal in the name of jesus my father today in the name of jesus i decree and i declare that all the angels all satanic angels that are in my altar that are in that altar to start to go down to start to go down as I pray, as I start my prayer altar, I declare and I declare that my angels will ascend up the ladder. I am ascending. I am going up in the name of Jesus. My Father, my Father, every dispatch center, every dispatch center, dispatch boys are in Columbia City. My twelve house. My colleagues are kitchen centers that distribute to neighbor. Yeah, what about distributors? There's a room. So that dispatch center, we cancel it. 
They are meeting in that altar. Yes, in the name of Jesus. Because it is their place of coordination. It is their place of cooperation. Therefore, we frustrate them. Let the presence of God be there. Let the heart of God visit every dispatch center, every coordination center, every place where decisions are taken because they don't take decisions on the street. They need an altar where they must sit down and make a decision. To say, Tulani, we want to destroy Tulani. Because it's a destiny carrier. So now what is it? When I see when I have the next sentence I have been I've been frustrated about where you had to take off. So I'm proud to say I'm a so proud. Yes. Praise the Lord. An altar is a place of imprisonment. That the Bosch ever called in those are who says cancel and unclean. Reports, decisions, legislation. These are the satanic altars that are speaking against the life in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Say, my father, I am raising an altar of intimacy. In the name of Jesus. My father, my father. According to Genesis chapter 12, chapter 12, verse 1 to 3, you spoke a word. To Abraham, you gave him promises. My father, Abraham's promises, Abraham's blessings are mine. Therefore, my father, I raise an altar in verse 7, an altar of intimacy. My father, today, I say, my father, I shall love you with all my heart, with all my mind. I shall pray, I shall raise up, I shall give praise unto you all the days of my life. In the name of Jesus, my father, my father. I am raising an altar like Abraham who raised an altar as he went to Egypt. When he came back, he raised an altar of no return. My father, I shall not go, I shall go back no more. Go back no more. Go back no more to my past. No more drugs, no more cigarettes, no more cigarettes, no more drinking. My father, no more fornication. Nothing, my father. My father, today I pray no more going bed, no more going bed, no more going bed. And say your consent, Abantu, and suppose in visa, and suppose in auto, Baban Colelo, Pussy Caslaco, I Casle Pussy, I Casle Coco, and Sakes, Monsuane, get up, my letters, Baban and Sanche. I am raising an altar of no return. I am no longer gossiping. I am no longer laughing against people who are going down the train. My father, my father, I am raising an altar of possession. I will possess my possession according to Genesis chapter 13, verse 17 to 18. Abraham raised an altar, an altar of possession. Raise up your hands. Kekendo shakata. Zuku kuta la raba. Zekata la rabo shakata. Zenda da la robo. Zekata la rabo shakete. We we are going back no more to our past. We are going back no more to our past. Raise up your hands. Say, my father, I need your presence. In my life, as I raise the altar, my father, this is better. My father, provide me with everything. My father, at midnight, speak to me, O oh Lord. I want to hear from you. Ikatele, I'm a false prophet. I tell last year, this time, Joseph Shati, Namkanje, Dololo. But in here is a seat. They stay at this time. They said that this year, last year, last year they said this time. Yeah. I'll be holding a CEO position. Do you know? But here they were saying, Pilin. And that appeared in Sakul. Do you know? But here it was a Mizulka man. This is a Mizulkan. Do you know? Baba Mizulka. Baba Mizulka. Baba Mizulka. My father, in the name of Jesus. Say, my father, my father, in the name of Jesus, I destroy 
every frustrating altar in my life. My father, my father, I am frustrating every disturbing altar, every frustration altar, every hindering altar, every antagonizing altar, every altar that is resisting my breakthrough in the name of Jesus. Father, today I declare and I declare every preventative altar that is preventing me, that is blocking me, not to move forward. My Father, what are you waiting for? I call your fire. Holy Ghost fire. Holy Ghost fire. Holy Ghost fire. Holy Ghost fire. Come down. Destroy every frustrating altar. Every frustrating altar. Consume every altar of hindrance to my progress. Destroy every altar of difficulty to my progress. Destroy every altar of opposition, of hatred, of spiritual punishment, of torture in the name of Jesus. Holy Ghost fire, what are you waiting for? Destroy any frustration altar in the name of Jesus. Any altar that is bringing frequent disappointment, frequent oppression, frequent suppression in the name of Jesus. Marakota, rakota, barakosa. You can't press it. It is another way, but you need to command. Yes, if you want, you can stand. If you want to sit, you can sit. Yes, in the name of Jesus. Raise up your hand. Say, Holy Ghost fire. Holy Ghost fire. Any altar of non achievement in my life, what are you waiting for? Altar of God. Altar of God. You are a consuming fire. Destroy every wicked delay. Every lack of results, every lack of reward in the name of Jesus. Any dream manipulation, any dream manipulation altar that has been raised to see myself walking in the river, eating at night, having sex in the dreams. My father, any altar of darkness in my life, I destroy you. I destroy you. Every altar that is resisting me, what are you waiting for? Holy Ghost, man. Holy Ghost fire, Holy Ghost fire. I'm a prophet of God. I'm a prophet of God. Let the Holy Ghost fire come down in the name of Jesus. Shine, Sandra. Sandra, I'm going to prepare a friend's feast. Guys, it's so much of a day. Shine, Sandra. Oh, Shine, Sandra. Shine, Satan in the Bible. Oh, Shine, Satan in the Bible. Shine, I'm a demon of frustrator. Who destroy and away with clap hands. Clap hands for you people. Clap hands for you people and shout with a louder voice. Say hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Say Holy Ghost fire. Seven times Holy Ghost fire. Holy Ghost fire. Holy Ghost fire. Holy Ghost fire. Holy, I don't hear you, but I start a threat from the sky. Holy Ghost fire. Shout out of your voices. Holy Ghost fire. 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 Holy Ghost fire! Holy Ghost fire! Destroy every evil altar in the name of Jesus. Turn it into ashes, my Father, my Father. In the name of Jesus, you may be seated. Ah, for the shumela ngi wan shumela na. There are seven songs coming. Let's hear one song. Ah, ngai. Ah, ngai. Ni na tunu kisha na relax. Sit on my right hand side until I make my enemies a footstool. I like all relevant for now, little things. Also, I like to let go. La, you will partake in the name of Jesus. Raise up your hands. Say every every negative altar, reacting, reacting against my progress. I cancel you by fire. Altar of my father. Altar of my father's house. Altar of my mother's house. What are you waiting for? Receive the Holy Ghost fire. Whatever altars that were raised from my mother's side, from my father's side, I destroy you. I destroy you in the name of Jesus. That's what to your shadow, daddy. To your shadow. In the twice, your keeper, my sister, your keeper. Yeah, one of my small local funny local in the EFT. You're a tournament. Yeah, I'm told I like it. Yeah, so no one has a yes upon my 
Tabani kwa nafuti mkono mkulu wa mshati suwa mtu na Mzabwa na hala Saba shane EFT kwa mtu mazani So, 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 you see, fine, but see, transfer, but there's a proof of payment. So, so, I want to pay for the proof of payment because we ask for anything. But I tell them, my mom, you better not pay me some. But I call about Kuluma. You are sending, eh? Sending. Yes. But I call about Kuluma. Who send the book on a pay call? Who send the Kamaraku come back? Who send the Kamaraku Ubani? Who come back? A book on a pay call. You broke the protocols that one night. When I hear a funny man who shot, who is on my altars? Even no mama who shot, they are not a man. Since I hear that I shot again, what force am I shot? When I foot we shot, where are we are resuscitating that altar? I go over there. Go and see what I shot. Do you want me to shot to speak with? Then I go come back. Get on the man, my love. To a little like funny lady, come come. That is the look to a tongue tied. We also spend the money to your reverses. I call me nanny, man. 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 Sit this your love boy. You have to pull that nice up, love boy. You tell him. Two weeks down the line, but I'm not part of this. But I'm not going to let them know I'm coming up to Brazil. I'm not joking, I'm telling you the truth. What a how powerful and effective satanic altars they can work against your destiny. I will tell you tell it how I was drinking, I was a drunkard. Being drinker, we bomb us with the soul. No. He can even push on I can even down on I waste I my young because of satanic altars as as we cry. Ushangana no mtu na una maolta zanjalo. Ba kuisele mufa. Boni toba zanu bonu kumu ya badegu ya gini. Uya api gini. Ubizo na olta zagini. Mimi mausha tiri. Ndo tama ito pa mdana. Ungezila. Uyo pega. Mabu mtana we ndota. Wari kazi ne ndote asu. Bai fone. Bang phone lima baga ka elish. Tua na mungta na la asna nda wugla la. When you close some fans when. Boso cha some fans wa kasna nda wugla la la tim. Mazo sichani la la we. Mazo bale we again. Mazo tiki na lika meru la kulesa sekor. Gani bizo ama old fans again. Ukosi utwa no hit bread win a when again. Huh? Umo sawa ko. Sindi oenza eka na. Mazo seven you must start focus at home. You cannot correct what your parents failed to do. No, no, no. That is not your duty. Whether you must move on, you must start now to build your own home. But you also, Mama, I consent. You are not boy. Oh, you are not short. You hit a boy. Fuck him, I let hit. Fuck him, I call drink. Ah ah. Come on, come on, baby, please. The guy, let me know the secrets. So I'm going to be there. I'm 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 so I'm going to be there. It is a Anna Mundoyo Puma. Hey! So, what do you have to do? When you have to stick the car in the car, you can't get it. 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 From the mother's house, whatever that was raised against my family, I cancel it. Any polygamy, altar that has been raised against my family. Oh, 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 in Kima. I want to absorb them for one. Bunga manyana. It's nonsense. Run away from that. 
Nena elwa ni pilo ya mi Geka ya maga chesu Namtanje baba Gia tandaza Geka ya maga chesu Walk on my altars That are blocking my opportunities That are paralyzing my goodness What are you waiting for? Catch fire now My father, my father Making one to be completely useless My father Any altar That makes me to be useless What are you waiting for? Catch fire now Any terrible Even monitoring altar In my life Any altar That is bringing irish, Irrational behavior In the name of Jesus What are you waiting for? Be destroyed now Every ungodly altar Controlling and regulating My life In the name of Jesus I destroy you now I destroy you now Any altar of, retard of retardation Any altar of stagnation Any altar that makes my life To come to a standstill In the name of Jesus I cancel you now I cancel you now Any altar that is making me To let success in every area of my life I cancel you now Altar of God Altar of prayer I am raising you against these altars They must fall down They must fall down They must collapse In the name of Jesus Father In the name of Jesus Raise up your hands. Any altar of strange sickness in your life. There are certain altars that are attacking me at night. I sit in the 11, half past 11. Charit. Gabuya. But from in the alone. Hey, what you go, son? Never give. I had a daughter. Bangi popola, bangi popola, bangi popola. And if I'm a PVC, but you know it's an MIR scan. How much is that? 10, 12,000. I had to pay that money. Because they pay my arms. I said, I cannot be paralyzed. My waist, I cannot be paralyzed. I am a physiotherapist. Why? Oh, the devil is raging. is raising a strange altar yeah. against my life. There are altars in our laser. We <laughs> She's a businesswoman. She's a businesswoman. Long time ago, I was a man around 20 years, eh? Driving. Uh, 20, as young as she was, riding a very big business. Hey! I never respected. She's a businesswoman. Turn up, Shannon, Zank, and come with a dish. Shout out for that. I'm seven and I was a toy. If you look out at the rest of the guys, push a little piece of a cool white fire and to give me a camera that you're seven. She drove at a very tender age. She was driving in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Raise up your hands. Any strange sickness in your body? Is it just a zagalayo? Is it just going to crave your funu kwa your funu chwala? Funa matoto, funa bafaz. So on keje le zindole. Zena suti jonga kala. Yes, nalo crave your WhatsApp. Funa kono nukla le msu. Njemo Elijah. Yeka amata jesu. Tana spa msene zanta. Yera katara masene. Yes. No medical investigation can bring that thing out. But God is making a surgical operation in our lives. Say, my father, any chronic sweat, any chronic disease that is making me to sweat and struggle, any strange sickness alters in the name of Jesus, anything that makes me to be unable to maintain the job, 
to be unable to maintain success, to be unable to maintain business, to be unable to maintain marriage, to be unable to be grounded and to be seated in one place. Ah, ah. Fire of God. Consume, consume these altars. altars. Any altar, altar that, is that is making me emotionally disturbed, spiritually disturbed, physically disturbed, mentally disturbed. I destroy you in the name of Jesus. Raise up your hand. Yes. So feel like this. Yes. Yes. When I'm a citizen, I text. I don't want to see how I'm to. I want to go to September, my fellow Lama Plumian and Ram. I want to call the Tosha Matev. By a Kulum, by a Kumadam Sigma Mutulai. This is what we call seasonal altars, seasonal attacks that you cannot explain. Raise up your hands. A kind of Fanishana Kulu and Jano. Kulmana. No, 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 no. These are the seasonal attacks. Fanelo no chow. Mak fanelo mak figure no date. There so turn into it. Tua umalu mega kwenye na ushoni. Umalu mugu fawa kenge na peglo bolu moba. Sina kuba ya se pambi. I know. Mara ego e postpone alizi. Niabuz. La la la. Sina set a mind like kai wote. Saturday. Sizoba, Sizoba is the unveiling of the tombstone. It's about corner a death. Do you know that we can't postpone that unveiling? We will try to squeeze funeral in between today and the, that day of unveiling of the tombstone. But I know why we finally postpone it. Hello? Why? It's 12 hours. Thank you. May one another live. I want to set an area under mine. I pray for you. Call an altar's alu and a pumele. Call a basha deal. As a material from the Pulaga who double bed was also a wound. But to an engine, I would toilet. Sasha says. They are back and Sasha. When we double bed, we are rolling. And then when we turn the woman to to and roll and jump, we are sailing. We are going to the. We go to the altar. We are begging. We go to where you cannot give birth. We must have to walk with under siege. Raise up your hands. We don't shout. The people say you must pray against such attacks. Find out how strong and how much you are consistent. Raise up your hands and say, My father, I destroy all these satanic altars. I shall marry, I shall give birth. My father, my womb shall conceive in the name of Jesus. Wherever they are, whatever they are doing in that tree altar where they are raising these satanic altars, my father, every tree altar that they have raised against my womb. I destroy it. When I was no Kaba, we have to come to an altar, a tree altar. What are you doing? Imam, you find a name on the yako. Imam, you find a name on the yako. Ufawa in Nalid. Yes, yes, yes. You want to do it apart with Imam. In the spiritual realm, it is a it is a fiber. I'm a fiber. So, Kashela, you can't conceive. Kashela, I'm a fellow pet choose. You can't do a movie. You can't do a movie. Uzo limbi za stembi so yoka imbi zwe hostel Uyo zipuzu zipuzu ubanga nani Luto emu tela Katikina ilaku na mwaltas Kule 
Benz on my altars, near Expendel, and my altars are can't deal. A Sassinova, oh, I go to Shilane. Connaissance, I said, I to go to next spring. I am telling you, I'm going to for almost 10 years. Go raise on altars under the tree. Do you understand what I'm trying to say? Go raise on any. Go clean your eyes. Sit them so shut. What about your mama? Jagupi flower. We are child, we are it is a spot. No matter how serious the matter is, they must never know my visit. I must come and push them. Sabonan in Jan Corner. Sapi the singer. I used to get lots and lots of accidents and a jam child. Remember. I understand on my part saying models. It's about my lost one jelly models, coco teddy model. Say my father. I am a tree altar that has been raised against my life. In the name of Jesus. I pray. As I pray, as I clap my hands, let that tree, let that tree wither now, wither now. Let it dry up to its roots. I pull it out and I throw it into the lake of fire. My father, my father, in the name of Jesus, any river altar that has been raised against my life, in the name of Jesus. Jesus. That will raise on our altars. Raise up your hands. But by Oglaza, I'm not in some of my own corner, I'm not in some because accidents because I'm altars that are speaking. Sacrifices that have been made. Who raise a man, river altars. I'm a river altars, in other words, you say, where now the marine powers must rule over you. When we talk of rivers, we are corner is in yoga, corner crocodile, corner on the vitian, the twisting serpent, the crooked serpent, the zoking to Zako Zat twist, zoking to Zako Zaka, Yoki Toki and Zaga. Ah! And the food that will raise up your hands. Hey, Amar River altars, they are washing your virtue, they are washing your breakthrough, they are washing, they are washing out your blessings, they are washing out what do we call this? Ama um, uh, blessings, alcohol, and the glory, alcohol. I'm telling you, you're telling a man's land prophet, no man's law, you are washing away yourself. I'm telling you, man's and things in my food. I'm going to find a totally anointing. I should say, go and buy it. I will pray over it and anoint yourself. I cannot merchandise in the house of God because an anointing oil is a symbol of the Holy Spirit. It means the presence of God. If you want that holy water, that water that you buy, must say, tap water, 
tell us we've got power to pray. Raise up your hands. Any altar, satanic altars that have been raised, that your life must be swallowed. I'm a finances. They are swallowing your finances. My altar in Dubai is Makabeta. What we call now? One cent, two cent, five cent, ten cent, twenty cent, fifty cent, one rand, two rand. Five rand, the armor paper, a ten rand, a twenty rand, a fifty rand, a hundred rand, and my name, a two hundred rand. My thing, let a low man, a job in Jalo, he would destroy her into bits and pieces. Venice, Venice, as of Chelaman, the bars, Shaman. Exactly <laughs> When I had to leave my job as a teacher, I had to stop working. 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 I had to stop to say, when I'm to when I'm to you can block my things. Now you sacrifice any man. You and the, 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 the traditionally then the you know what the ground has been called to become a witness in this covenant and inside pants no more pants or will be pants to a shy pants to a telescope will be Today we are cancelling that in the name of Jesus. We are kumbula mus. But if I thousand, I'm going to tell you put a stone on the ground he poured an oil and he started to pray as he was praying why is I speak ends the ground as a witness between the and the crowd must be a witness that this altar finally the corner and the altar the altar Local altar. I am delivered from any local altar in the name of Jesus. They are in the place where we are. We have altar in blood shedding. Blood shedding, like funny culture to take it as Jalundi. I can't move this, so I want to leave myself stay with Zanala. And I let every day go for that. There are cases that are not important. It's a local altar. Now when I alter my drugs, when I alter no drug, 
We need to do what we call a prayer walk. See, Fafazika Zilla Jesu, who's a zonky tried. More for the strat in some quoting Fafazika Zilla Jesu. In Amla Wonka Matibun, in Amla Wonka, and my spirits are calling and get Gamma Gajes. We have one of the strats, you some woman pain and I saw my money in some woman. Ray. Elijah. Raise up your hand. Say, my father, any death altar that has been raised against my family, against my life, my father, I shall not die prematurely. My father, every untimely death in my life, I cancel you. I cancel you. I cancel you. My father, I shall not die spiritually. I shall not die physically. In the name of Jesus, my father, today, I decree and I declare your holiness in the name of Jesus. Raise up your hands. On my international altars, the Bonilla must international altar, the COVID, if you learn it, it affected me, and must discover the Mabesh of what he learned. It can do it. I don't know, sir, but it's a good show. I don't know, it was what an international altar. So, as I conform into the standards, I'm trying to see online by force. Hey, Colin, I've done a funda online. They raised an international altar so that they can pursue their what? Their own business. They don't mind. They can sacrifice our lives just for the sake of what? Of the business. Raise up your hands. Colin, I'm about to use the monkey pox. I was just telling my mind, to call the chemist, Stefan Sotena, I'm a pill inside till. And why do you benefit from the COVID? Did you benefit? You know, take some mask. You know, take some pills. If this and they were never mentioned. <laughs> 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 but it was a mass zinc. Puts an aluminium, and as this was a truly this was a zocula, this and that's been. A man vitamin A, B, C, D, C, and orange, that and a massacre of orange, so I can move to us like this. Or a summer in it, the coffee, to make a man like this, amen. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! Hallelujah. 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 Amula walk on international altars. Amula walk on continental altars. In the name of Jesus. Lanela, yes, on my continental altars. Continental in Africa. Yes, we take such a way cook is across. Boy, Yangin. Why in Nigeria, certain Sukuk? We have with one of the South Africa, we have Zimbabwe, we have Mozambique, we are everywhere in Africa. Go raise our altar, man. We cook. We have to learn the boss. These are the continental what? Altars, a blood shedding. I get home to an eye, he's a kind of 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 a
Ohlala njalo bakutso fanele ukudoka ukuthi baba egameni lakho Bonke ama local altars bonke ama continental altars in the name of Jesus I cancel them in the name of Jesus Yoke key poverty altar ekhona empilweni yami ngegama ka Jesus Yoke poverty altar we are sebenza auna man au sebenza auna man If is this guy was going down the drain call him in the oh I'm frustrated and I will mention it come and I never prayed I said Lord this matter concerns you Where is of food one robber one shy man there many is of food Mbathe le bang to do zai postoli zobarai Mbathe na man Nje ubabu khale le ngane Ufuna hamba bangwenzele onzo wenzele ukuthi hey kwenzeke ukuthi kwenzeke ukuthi kwenzeke ukuthi Peter I don't have man Yeah basu I know some want to say I'm a beggar and this is a spirit of poverty my father I don't tell you kunkulu wayivala wayivala nje yonke le mala ngirobe yona kufanele ukuthi manje alungise yakhe property kwamosheka zonke into zakhe negama ka Jesus Raise up your hands. Walk up to when Zagabe. The camera that you should look for, Madara means Zagabe. It's Baba. Walk up my altars as if it's fire. In the name of Happy Me, let them receive fire now. Let them receive fire now. In the name of Jesus, whoever pretends to help me, that is I. My property is I. My marriage is I. My church. In the name of Jesus, I cancel. I cancel it. I cancel it. I cancel it. In the name of Jesus, raise up your hands. Family altars, sing your part. My family altars. The guy like a pastor called him Sam. Tell us, Father, 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 Bingelelwa yini amathuna So ama altars asikhaya yini amathuna Sibingelelwa ukuthi sibethwe in the spirit of sight of death So the spirit of that so that I know so general I must speak la In the name of Jesus Tsala sume msesevela We need to pray against palace altars Palace altars Palace altars. Mr. Dyer, this one's done. If you are from a royal family, 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 if you are from a chieftain, chieftainship, if you are chieftainship, chieftains, from a very big surname like now bombard and okay you will find it but everywhere in the continent of africa promises and we want to go africa to the whole africa all over the africa let's apply and say my father any palace or church that are raised that are supervising in the name of jesus i cancel any market order that has been raised In the name of Jesus to frustrate my word to frustrate my business my father my father in the name of Jesus I decree and I declare my father that in the name of Jesus I cancel every market altar that is racing against my life in the name of Jesus Jesus la 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 ma sense competition a business anyone Can you see part and I'm intending part as a brand? So say by now the unhealthy competition. You didn't tell me what I mean. My bad. My bad. I know since I'm going to be mad at you. Tell me what you're going to do. No, you failed last time we put it in. Any a butcher or no butcher? You're not going to put my balls here. I'm 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 not going to put my balls here. Ukuthi zonke izinto zakho ezikujelwa. Khona baye bajonjelwa amaphenda, kujelwa kudala amaphenda, sele azabola nokubona. Abanye bathathana ama menstrual tampons, agujelwa abanye bathathana ama underpants, 
Microphone very bit of Pelama Pet. Who's got what in Slama Pet? Who got to go to church and next? I go second. I'm Mrs. Zang. Who got to have a pet lock here? Who got to have a shot? Bosch and a paint. Bosch and a pair of hands. That was case last year. They got good. From now moving forward, my menstrual pets are more the short Say, blood of Jesus, blood of Jesus, establish a new covenant in my life. Blood of Jesus, destroy every hair, every fingernail, every armpit, every pubic hair, every shaven hair that was donated in the altar in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Was 
Father, I destroy everything. My Father, I shall no longer see myself dancing in the shrine, dancing in the, in the forest. My Father, I will no longer see myself swimming in the river. In the name of Jesus, I will never be chased. In the name of Jesus, Maraco Tarabasiki Tenebesan, Rapa Paroco Torabasin, Elaka Tarabasiki, Sanga Tarabasiki, Mama Coco Tarabasin, Elaka Tarabasiki, Hippa Paraco Torabasan. In the name of Jesus, raise up your hands as we are closing. I want you to accept Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior. These altars need us to renew, to renew our covenant with God. I don't care whether you accepted him in 1960 or yesterday, but today you must. It's the last. So that you can see God doing things in your life. The Bible says in the book of 1 Corinthians chapter 1 verse 10, He delivered us. He never stopped to deliver them, but He delivers us. He will continue to deliver us. So now we need to always renew our vows with God. Raise up your hands, all of you. Say, Father, Father in, the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, I invite you, I invite you as my Lord and Savior in, in my life. My Father, my all the altars, all the altars that, that I have made mention of, made let your blood let your wash them away. Wash I accept, I accept you as my Lord and Savior, and, Lord and I confess and I with my mouth with my that mouth, you are Lord Jesus. Jesus. In the name of Jesus, name of my Jesus. Father, I fight Father. my battle. In, in the name of Jesus, as I raise as I an raise altar an of reading your word, as I raise an altar of praying, as I raise an altar of tithes and offering, as I raise an altar of giving alms in the name of Jesus. My Father today, I thank you in the name of Jesus. Nothing by any means shall hurt me. Nothing by any means shall hurt me. My Father, I decree and I declare Psalms 35 verse 1. Fight my fighters. Contend my contenders. Arrest my arrest. Arrest my arresters. My Father, let the eaters of flesh, let the creatures of blood, drink their own blood, eat their own flesh, in the name of Jesus. Pray, as we declare, no accident, nothing. In the name of Jesus.
ሰንቆጥቶችን ነገር ነው ጥሩ ፈጂ ማለስረስ ፕሊስ እንዴ ባያማ ኮይን ሰዘ ጎመን ለስ ነገር ነው ማኮንስ ፈጂ ማለት ከተለ እይ ባፈን ዘመ መስፈና ማኮን ደስ አንባስ ለፊልም ሱይ እንዴ ማባው ገበስ ዴዲኬተር ዘብ ሰዘ ጎመን ለላ ሰንቲ ለቸው ፍስ ማለት ከተለ ተማተማ <laughs> baba aguti le minigelo i break all the old tasks la pe manza go baba eza chotswa khona eza fihlwa khona namhlanje baba sikhuluma baba isikusi tshoke gama la Jesu baba banikeza ma resources banikeza ma finances bazokwazi kusponsor le shumisenzi kaNkulunkulu siyazi ukuthi usathana utshotshe imali baba okuzazo lethi frustration endle nga Jehova baba namhlanje siyathandaza ukuthi baphi misebenza bangasebenza bapha ma promotion abasebenzayo baba banikeze all the desires of your heart so that they will come and give thanks baba today they are raising as a a vow offering baba namanje bayazobuye bazoletha ma tithes and offerings ngegama lethe so bazothi senza umsebenzi wakho baba uyashu ukuthi abane enhliziyo evuma ma balethu umnikelo according to Exodus chapter 25 verse 2 u verse 8 baba ngegama la Jesu ukuthi khona sizokwazi ukuthi sakhe indlu yakho yokukhonzela namhlanje baba siyathandaza banike zimisebenzi naba badona bakho baba sibaletha kuwe ngegama la Jesu bayafisa kodwa bayashwele Baba baba ya fees what about soil what about baba provide you are Jehovah Jireh you shall provide them you shall protect them you shall give them the desires of their hearts in the name of Jesus baba vula yonke iminyango vula yonke iminyango baba ba connect to people about my destiny connectors baba ba connect to people about my my resources bakwazi ukuthi bapromulgate ukusebenzisa kuNkulunkulu baba namanje siyathandaza siyabonga gama lakho ngegama la Jesu laba basikola online ngizonipha inbox I will inbox you the account number so that you can deposit in the name of Jesus. Tsala chain is and bomb in Kulu Kulu and Nigelo in Kulu and Kanda Kulu. Any nibasha I forgot to tell you there to the nibasha that Kulu ke kama la Jesus. Sebonga ka Kulu ke kama la Jesus. Amen then. Amen. Thank you so much. Tsala chain is and that's the reason as we shall be seen. Yes, yes, yes. Thank you so much for being with us. I love you so much and God loves you. And thanks for this uh, service in the name of Jesus and I hope you benefited a lot in the name of Jesus. I always preach my testimonies most of the times and I am led as per the spirit leads to say this is what is needed in the name of Jesus amen and amen. Bana begin to mazan de ngis tshonje le zai tshatulo le zi. Ah ngis tshonje le pheno ya. They are so beautiful man. Thanks so much. Ah usaka konza na tshela no mshayi ndzaka so bathinga bata bashaya le kai la le tshe. Ndo bona ga le tshe le bo. So there are less spawn and start to you can stop that. Shalom shalom. Uh, thanks special wait special greetings to apostle our bishop Alex Mwami from Holy Ghost House next but thank you so much step and also Dr. Sibi Khatebe from Great Road Ministries thank you so much for the great impact that you are doing I also special greetings to Dr. V M Mavunga in the name of Jesus he will be here in South Africa all the way from Lusaka he will be coming here in the name of Jesus yes around late October in the name of Jesus father thank you so much he's the one who taught me all these things in the name of Jesus thank you so much in Jesus name and all protocol observe members oh, from Cairo from Cape to Cairo pastors apostles everyone thank you so much as bishop thank you williams my father thank you so much in the name of Jesus in Jesus name amen shalom shalom thank you